Now, to make things easier for you, you will want to work on new tracks and multiple layers. This at the moment, what I've done is not really great if you want to actually isolate specific sounds or specific layers. What you can do is you can go to track, add a new stereo track. The reason why you want stereo is because stereo is two sounds, all right? Mono is just one sound, but if you want to get a higher quality, we go for stereo. So I'm going to add a new track in, stereo track, and can you see I've now got that layer below? What I can do is I can highlight that whole track. I can go to edit, all right, and cut. And then down here in my new layer, I can go to edit and paste. I've now got multiple layers, all right? And it will still run. So if I go, if I start from here, So, right. But now I'm going to put in a sound effect of somebody laughing because of the silly noises. But what I'm going to do is add a new track in, stereo track. I'm going to go down here and I'm going to go to file, import audio. Now you should be able to, from your files and from your Google Drive, if you've got files there, actually access them from your menus. Okay, so you should be able to access that. I'm going to put the laughing sound in now. Now, what you'll notice is it's quite, it's gone quite big. You can zoom out, all right? So up here, you can zoom out and, and look at your layers and scroll up and down. Now, that layer did go on to a new track, all right? But to make sure it is sequential and in the right order, what I can do is highlight that, edit, cut, and make sure it's in line with the rest of it. Edit, paste. So I'm going to go back to this. <laughs> Doesn't really make much sense, but now what we are going to do as a result of this we are going to you can add in background music there might be some ambient music that you want playing in the background the whole time especially if you have set the scene in a specific location like a supermarket or maybe a playground so some of you may be asking how do you change the volume of specific clips I'm going to show you that in our next video.